So, boy T, your favorite slacker here. I actually had to watch my own playthrough video to catch me back up with what Jerk Shepherd is up to. And, you know, I'm totally stacking views on my own videos. <laughs> Get at me. Anyway, we're doing stuff for Arya, so Trinity wants us to do stuff because we're the one. Quick, hands behind your back. We'll be here any minute. Roleplay costs extra. Crete, Blood Pack's leader. Arya brings him the Greek commander Shepard. Crete pledges the gang to her. We're just luring him into the open so we can take him out. Not the best start to our friendship, Narl. He's coming. Put Most people start back. with a handshake. Uh, try to look like a Not sodomy, I'm just saying. This goes wrong. It's your ass. No, it's your ass, Shepard. <laughs> I have to look even more powerful than Crick thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. Now this. <sighs> Commander Shepard wants you to blow. Your head will be hood ornament on my personal shuttle. Keep your distance, Creed. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? <sighs> Most definitely. Arya can use blood pack as she sees fit. Someone get this dude some Ricola, my god. Grill? What? You have my word. Now open Oh, the green one is a traitor. That's not even a renegade option. I just kill him. Not him. Grill's next in line to take over. Arya's deal is with him. All right. Yes. Yes. I'm Arya's mole, Shepard. You've scratched my back. Now I scratch yours. So I don't want you anywhere behind me. Advice. Anywhere. Don't double cross. Be anywhere me. behind me. I Bet mean, enough of dudes crazy, behind me. But I'm not crazy. Uh huh. Good work, Neural. Thanks for the gun. Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. Okay. Where are we going? I don't care about the council races. RT Loke has requested assistance uniting mercenary bands under her control. Speak to Darner Vosk in the Citadel refugee camp. RT Loke has requested assistance uniting mercenary bands. Blah blah blah. Speak to Commander Bailey's assistant at the Presidium's Column C-Sec station and gain the allegiance of the Eclipse Band. Okay. So let's go do the refugee one, because I'm close to leaving this place. That was the name of this movie, Scary Potter? I mean, <laughs> that chick is so scary! Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. Doc's holding her. can't believe that the Citadel doesn't have, like, a Spanish. Because I speak so good of Spanish. I mean, un momento. Like, that's what I wanted to hear, not one moment. Shit's racist. So friggin' racist. to move their ship out of the docking bay. Oh, so I can either get him in or make him leave? Make you know him what, leave, I'm a renegade. The docks authorized to fly. Right. We'll follow through if the situation forces us to. But they're civilians. And they're keeping military ships from doing their jobs. Yeah. I'm contacting docking central. If that ship isn't shoving off in 30 seconds. Don't fire. I'll I'll tell them to We go. hate civilians here. We could have made space, but who cares? I didn't get any plus reputation for that. Cause I'm a dick. Hey guy. Whoa. 
Not bad, Solarian. Dude, he's marrying up. Alright, there's nothing to do here either. Oh, it's Deckard Kane. What's up, Deckard Kane? <laughs> oh, Dekar, pardon me. I recovered your pillars of strength. The kite Fifteen thousand credits. Thank you. Waiting in Bay D twenty four. What are you selling? Welcome to Vitarian State Arms. What guns do we even use? I forgot. Uh oh. <laughs> uh, let's take the. Shotgun high caliber barrel, because I'm pretty sure I use a shotty. Thought you watched your other video, Wired! Scanned. Skimmed is a better word. Skimmed my other video. <laughs> Fight the power, Batarians. Fight the power. Oh my god, it's Kelly Chambers. I saved you. Kelly Chambers. Shepard, it's really you. You. I don't hug. I've been so worried. Without my Cerberus contacts, I had no way of knowing if you'd survived the invasion. Stay here. Looks like there were a lot of people here who could use your help. There is. I feel I'm making a real difference. If there was ever a reason I studied psychology, it was to help people. Her invitation them. is in the mail. Don't take chances with Cerberus. Change your look. Change your name. Get new identification. That takes time, and the people here need my help. Do it, Kelly. Okay, I will. If you think I should. I'm so glad you found me. Seeing you makes everything... Now shut up and get in the kitchen and cook these survivors some run. food, damn it. Please be careful. Where do you need to run to? She was living in a shack. She was looking into a shack. She was playing shadow puppets on the wall or something. I don't know what she was doing over here. It's their only form of entertainment. <laughs> Shadow puppetry. Wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great Commander Shepard on a leash. I'm here for my own reasons, Bosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. Oraka. Why does that name sound familiar? Hold on. Brainstorming. He's the general from Korra's Den in the first game. Who was all drunk and shit. And you, like, get him to not be drunk anymore. Commander you get him to go to AA. Blue Sun's trash, huh? That Arya is sure something special. Oh, and, uh... <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. You knew about this? Can you be more specific? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Araka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Araka to stop disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Araka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of it. No need to candy coat it, Arya. I just don't see why you couldn't tell me the details yourself. Vosk needed to see you, needed to realize who he's dealing with. Plus, if I have to suffer that scumbag staring at my tits one more time, I might have to kill him. Kill him, Trinity! Yeah, kill him! He mentioned... That I'm going to sleep with him? We all have our delusions. Of course you're not going to sleep with him, because he's going to sleep with me, because I'm Jerk Shepherd, and Jerk Shepherd gets the women's. It's freaking pansy-ass Paragon Shepherd that doesn't get any ladies. Or he gets all the ugly ones. Let's check on those medical supplies. Yes, sir. Is that one Garrus Falcarian? The surgeon's there. Keep on it. Some of these wounded don't have. You have a copy of a Shepherd VI? 
Is that seriously the Shepard VI that's been like... We locked it after some kid spilled soda over the hardware. I'll unlock it, but we've only got the demo version worth I'm taller than the VI. How does that even make sense? It's not anatomically correct. Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Looks like you've been in some fights lately. Install me in a combat mech and I can do some pretty crazy damage myself. I don't talk like that. I find the best advanced battlefield strategy is to have more bullets than the other guy. Technically, it's thermal clamps, not bullets. But who says I filled them with five detachable heat sinks? Who would buy that? Gares <laughs> is like me? Shepard. Don't get personal, bitch. What's happening? We convinced the council to accept our wounded. Nowhere else to go. How bad is it? More dead than injured. 85% killed in action. We'll need a morgue soon. Not a lot of flesh wounds when you're fighting rapers. <laughs> Can, they Can still we patch him up? Get him back into the fight? Maybe a few, though it'd be pretty much a death sentence. Do We're it. all facing a death sentence. Better a soldier goes down fighting than waited out here. A lot of them would agree, but my people are running low on guns, ammo, transports. We have to ration it out to the troops who are still helping. Steal from the Volus! Any sign of your family? Not yet, but I keep hoping. What about you? I'm starting to see some wear and tear. It's nothing I can't handle. I don't doubt it, but remember to come up for air. There's a lot more war to go. Does Shepard even breathe? He's a freaking robot now. So we updated that. I wish these... Getting mad. <laughs> General Rocka, I have his way for committing the sons. Find a deal with Oraka. Clips. I talked to Bailey's assistant, but I can't remember. Oh my god, I can't remember. Did I talk to him already? See, these are the perks, man. These are the perks of being a slacker. Because when you slack off as much as I do, you basically don't even remember where you are in a video game. <laughs> so it's like a guessing game. Did I do this already? Did I not? Now arriving at but luckily I have actual video documentation of everything I do on video games, which is very sad, by the way. Oh, General Raka, poor you. You are totally going to die. Commander Shepard. Your General Raka? Reinstated. I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. CSEC is not even fighting the war. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top-line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. The Blue Suns can make life difficult for you. Impossible, even. You think I'm afraid of death? Palavan is in ruins. My people are dying by the millions. No, I'm not backing down, no matter what. 
Send in Antonio Banderas and Sylvester Stallone, because this guy's Excuse gonna me, die. Sir. Good to see you again, Shepard. The general won't listen to reason. Take him out. Well, it was worth a try. I like I just literally assassinated that guy ten feet from him. He's just like, oh. Still not budging, Shepard. I don't care if you're gonna kill me or not. I'm not budging. Alright, so Commander Bailey's friend is up here or whatever, because I saw the CSEC logo when I ran by. I must have already talked to this guy. Or not. What just happened? Oh! Okay. Did I talk to you already? Apparently I did, because he's giving me the cold shoulder. Oh look, I got another, like, quest for being an old lady and, like, dropping in on everyone's conversation. That is so stupid. Like, why would Shepard need to listen to people's problems? <laughs> it's like, oh, I was eavesdropping and I overheard that you need three dollars for your laundry. Here's three dollars. Remember to join the military so you can die in combat. No, I didn't want to go there! <laughs> Oh, it's so bad. I am so bad. I didn't even want to go there. I wanted to go to the embassy so I could talk to Bailey about his friend who's being mean to me. He's incredibly rude to me. That was totally a sad face sigh, by the way. Come on, man. I want to go to the embassies. Thank you. Who is messaging me? Quit texting me. That's right, you guys get the real digs here. You get to see everything live action, man. Me texting, everything. Enjoy. Don't get this kind of real life quality anywhere else. Yes, I have spoken to you before. Why do you refuse? Because you're wearing eye makeup, bro. That's why you're being refused. If you want respect, you can't wear eyeliner. Did we just play like another half hour and actually kill nothing? Oh wait, we killed Araka, but I don't even get to see him die. Good morning. Uh, Cause Antonio Banderas works in the later hours of the day. Oh my god, you fat load. You make a better wall than a window. Get out of my way. Alright, here we go. Oh, I didn't even talk to Bailey. Shepard, to what do I owe the pleasure? Here to talk about you releasing Jonas Sedaris. Damn, you too? Somebody got the council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. That's a fancy way of saying mind your own business. Look, there's no way I'm letting that psychopath out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. This is bigger than Sedaris or you or me. The council's orders must be obeyed. No, I hear where you're coming from, but this is cut and dry. I'll tell you what, if you meet her and honestly think she should be released, I'll do it. You pain in the Go ass. Go outpost. My assistant will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. This man needs a specter slap as soon as possible. Do you see what I did to the girl outside? I will do five times worse to you. And she was a chick and a reporter. And I knocked her out <laughs> with a headbutt. I will rearrange your face even worse, Bailey. Bailey's like, I don't even care. I'm ugly enough as it is, man. Welcome, Let's just say Bailey's Please not getting laid. And that's why he's so angry. Where are we supposed to go? If you have a question, 
supposed to go to the commons? Again, for like the fifth time. Damn you, Bioware! This shit's worse than a Resident Evil game with all the backtracking. I'm actually checking my watch. I think I forgot how to play this game now because of all this freaking talking. Like, seriously, there's so much random crap. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. After all, it's not like I'm the reason you're breaking up with me, right? At least I can bring my swagger with me when I wander out. <laughs> Bouncing left and right. Like a boss. Now you'll talk to me because Bailey gave the okay. I've met with Jonas Sedaris and her cell commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. Oh, oh, oh yes. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. Bitch, are you kidding me? It'd be smart to bury the threat, Sedaris. I'll toss them into the caskets with my victims. I love holding all the cards. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Saying my second in command is a weak willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. No, she's a model citizen, of course. Defying this order is violating the law. You have to let her out. Well, I'm Jerk Shepard. I, I would, I don't want to release her, but <laughs> we made a compromise that every renegade choice would be chosen for the sake of it. All right, are we done doing Arya's freaking errands and being a little lapdog for the day? Like seriously, I might as well just hop into her arms and become like a little Paris Hilton dog for her because sick of following orders. I want to kill something. Renegade sucks. I'm not even going to talk to Arya to, like, get her approval. We're just leaving. <laughs> We're leaving! Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. One moment, please. I just like to get the fudge out of here. That's what I want to select. Get me off this space station. It is a time sink. The first thing that's wrong with this place is it's way too damn shiny. It is way too shiny. I don't trust anything that's this shiny. It's crazy now shiny here. Is there anyone else I should yell at before I leave? I don't think so. Good. Hey! Look at this! We might actually get some gameplay done in this video, which would be amazing. <laughs> Simply amazing.
were flying, flying away. We were flying. Your private terminal. Why is your neck broken? Stop vomiting peas all over. We're getting reinforcements to a group called the N7 Special Ops by Hackett. Okay. And that's it. Not talking to anybody. I'm going antisocial so we can actually beat something. Meet with the diplomats. Rescue the students. Let's do that. Let's rescue some psychic people. How will people make life decisions without psychic people on the phone? Come on, man. This is priority one. How dare we think that meeting with a bunch of friggin' diplomats is more important than actually getting a free tarot reading? Like, what the hell? Kidding me? Oh yeah, the gang's all here. Alright, who are we gonna roll with? We're soldiers, so I wanna take Garrus. Because he's awesome. Oh yeah, I have all the alternate costumes. Garrus. That's like some Desert Storm type shit right there, and let's try out Edie. Can I change Edie's costume first? What does she have? She's got like silver. She's also got the costume. She's got Miranda's costume. Kinda miss Miranda. She was a good squad member. We didn't upgrade anything or apply any mods or anything. I was just, because I'm sick of talking and being in menus and shit, so. Let's run right into this. Thank you. I think it's stabilizer and the damage increase. And I'm not carrying a shotgun. No wonder, they're so heavy. Alright, I guess that's all we're gonna take. What else do I got? Due to prior reconstructive surgery, your implants that are still healing aggressive behavior have caused them to reopen. Oh my god, I don't want to be ugly. I'm such a pretty man. What do we want to upgrade? Uh, frag grenade, I guess. Let's go with damage. I'm pretty good with the frag, so I it's like I could thread a needle with the frag. I should have... I should have probably upgraded the rest of the guys. I didn't. I think Garrus is upgraded already from the last level, but Edie we've never used. Because she was too busy banging Joker or some shit. Or like going to the movies with Joker and giving a handy during the movie. I mean, what? I'm sorry. My mind wanders. It's the weirdest thing. And there's the folks who answered the distress call. Cerberus Cruiser. At least a dozen fighters on blockade duty. Not too many for us in a straight-up fight. They must want this place bad. Receiving incoming transmission. Let's hear it. SSB Normandy, this is Kaylee Sanders, director of Grissom Academy. We need immediate assistance. Cerberus is attacking the facility. They're after my students. This is Commander Shepard. We're blocked on a direct approach. I know. They've taken control of our docking base. Any alternatives? There's an auxiliary cargo port I could probably open. All right. We'll come in by shuttle and get your students out of there. By the way, Joker, what are you wearing? Give me a diversion. I mean... <laughs> oh, boy, can I? Can you? What is he going to do? Joker, I hope you're not going to be throwing tomatoes and shit again. You know what happened last time. in a straight line and they couldn't even hit him. Cerberus is terrible. <laughs> so bad. Keep the shuttle in position. We'll be back. 